we're looking at summer pruning these what peach tree, oh. tree that we pruned in the winter, with a view to minimising the pruning that has to happen in winter time, which are harder wood to cut, leave bigger wounds that heal more slowly than they will now while the sap's actively flowing. And so we're aiming to shape the tree and to turn it into a vase shape, open it up from the middle, and take out wood that's growing inwards. We're trying to create the growth on a horizontal frame but around the tree. And we will just take out a little bit of dead wood or other problems that have occurred while we do that. So we'll start on it. We've got one side of this tree is really quite weak still, which is a bit of a problem, but it's, it's in keeping with what had happened when we pruned it originally, because this side was lower than the other, and it actually demonstrates why, if it's possible, we're better to keep the height of the whole tree the same, because the vigour has gone to those higher points. Yeah. Well, we could do that, couldn't we? We could, we could lower it a bit. We can stage, because we're past a yeah, fruiting stage. That's right, we get yeah. the fruit. Yeah. Okay, so to try and bring a stronger leader out here because this is not really healthy, I'll take this in a little further. And this can become mm. the tip of the new leader out here. We've got one rubbed off here. So he'll come off. This could create another leader through this way. We will try that. So a lot of what we do in this sort of pruning, well in all pruning, is just trying to create the tree of the future. Mm -hmm. Down in here, this is definitely a fruiting lateral. So what I'm going to do, it was left this long last year in an effort to get some fruit and flower off it in the pruning. Oh, that's not good. It's chopped that, but I'm going to tip it because I don't want it to keep growing any longer. Mm. There's room here. There's more light gets in here that will set fruit buds along each of these leaf buds and we'll get a choice of plenty of fruit mm. down inside. We've got potential limbs here. A little bit of dead wood off. This limb happening here. Shortening the laterals that are happening. and that's largely taken care of on that limb. So this is going to hit set yep. the yep. overall height, yep. Good. roughly. Yep. So some of this is going to look a bit ugly and trying to reduce it to come back yep. in scale. Yep. We might take yep. this whole fellow off. This we want to be just fruiting laterals, but we're always trying to bring them back in closer mm to the framework of the tree. So here is actually a really nice lateral. That yep. can come off. Yep. Shorten the one up inside and we've got a chance of developing fruit buds here mm. where we want them. So we'll do the same thing here. Mm. Same on this one out front. We could at this stage in the season because you'll have growth for yeah. another yeah. six or seven months. Yeah. Cut back to this bud because yeah. it's active. You might do that. Yeah. Now this. You want it cut back. It is ugly. To get it to the right part. We kind of are nearly going to make this a leader, but we might cheat at the moment. Yeah. And leave that. Mm -hmm. So we fork that branch. Yeah. Create two leaders. So just coming around the tree further. Trying to come back. This is what we're looking to have happen actually. This, these laterals are developing off the limbs. Mm -hmm. Quite nicely spaced. Shorten those to encourage them mm -hmm. not to keep growing. Because yeah, yeah. it's that long growth that created these mm -hmm. things that just keep going out. There's a, limb, a new growth up the inside of the tree. Mm -hmm. We have no need for. So he comes out. Inside, inside comes out. What we're doing is letting a lot more light in, mm. which will help produce fruit buds in the lower parts of the tree, particularly. If it's shaded, each of these leaves here will produce just leaf buds mm. if it's quite heavy shade. Mm. But opening up, letting the light in will allow fruit buds to develop. Mm. 
and the whole purpose of the tree is to Get feed you. <laughs> That's right. So this is just to do with removing the height. Yep. And well, now the height's got to come down yep. again here. We have what is turning into what I regard as a beautiful leader. There's mm. quite a strong shoot here mm -hmm. that's in the right position. Mm. So we'll regard that as a leader, yep. which means we'll turn this into a freezing arm. Mm. There's a freezing lateral in the back. Shorten that one up. A little bit of dead off, shorten here. So as we go around the tree, the height's coming down. Mm. This is still way stronger yeah. than the far side. Mm -hmm. So what I'm actually going to do is cut this to an outward facing bud. Yeah. So it's coming yep. in the direction we'd like its growth to continue. Mm -hmm. And while I haven't tipped these others, they're going to just become that little bit stronger yeah. in comparison. This will quickly shoot again yeah. Yeah. and catch up. Right. Mm. So just taking wood out inside that's creating shade. Aiming to produce good fruiting laterals that are going sideways from our mainframe. This is not healthy. A lot of spare wood here. Mm -hmm. This is not turning into a limb. Mm -hmm. I think we'll just take it back yeah. to fruiting lateral production. Mm -hmm. uh, this one's not looking that healthy. Yeah. I'll take that off. Uh, it's too high. Yeah. Uh, so I probably might even take it right off. Yep. Uh, um, and then that's very strong. I don't know whether I'll take it back there. Uh, Actually, that's a downward growth yeah, bud. Yeah, which I don't think that's good, is it? It needs to be more natural. It's an interesting one because you've got two choices of making leader here, as far as I see. Yeah. One is this young shoot. Yeah, yeah. It's or good. this shoot back in. Mm, mm. This one's coming off a horizontal piece of wood, yeah. which probably serves the purposes yeah. of this tree because you don't want it to That's right. end up getting higher and higher yeah. and hard to manage. Mm. Yes, I probably so so you yeah. want that form to happen. Mm. And that one would come off yes. because this naturally being higher yeah. and want to become dominant. Mm. Fruiting lateral here and here. Yeah. Then off. And because this is so much stronger yet again, yeah. we'll take them to an upward facing bud in this instance. Mm. So we don't, uh, a bud coming here would be falling down yeah. and weaker the yeah. joint. Right. So we'll go to an upward facing bud. Mm. That tree opened up. Yeah, it's beautiful. Mm. So Get some paste and put it on all these wounds. One pitch tree done. <laughs>